Shams, this has been a busy offseason for you, and we've been waiting for two big dominoes to fall revolving Kevin Durant and Donovan Mitchell. What's the latest with Donovan Mitchell? As of right now, sources tell me that talks between the Jazz and the Knicks around a Donovan Mitchell trade have stalled out. I'm told there hasn't been contact between the two sides in roughly the last two weeks. And, Brooke, this is right now. This is current. This, these things can always be fluid, but this is where it stands right now. And clearly, there's, there's really no movement as of yet on the Mitchell to the Knicks front. But in the meantime, I'm told that the Jazz are continuing conversations with other teams that are interested in Mitchell, teams like Charlotte and Washington, I'm told. Uh, but overall, throughout this entire process, the Knicks have been the focus of many around the league, including the Jazz when it comes to Donovan Mitchell, because they have eight first-round draft picks at their disposal to use via trade. They have a couple of young, young players like Quentin Grimes, Obi Toppin, that could be of interest to teams around the league, including the Jazz and a deal for Donovan Mitchell. So all eyes will continue to be on the Knicks as a potential suitor. But as of right now, no new movement on Mitchell to the Knicks. OK, well, what's a timeline look like for a deal of this magnitude? There's no deadline in the offseason. Of course, we know during the NBA season, there's a February trade deadline. But the closest thing, Brooke, I think to an unofficial trade deadline is September 26th when training camp and media day begins. That is really the unofficial deadline that all the teams have. When you look at Donovan Mitchell trade talks, when you look at Kevin Durant trade talks. But again, those two guys do have multiple years left on their deal. Kevin Durant has four years left on his deal. Um, when you look at Donovan Mitchell, he's got three years left on his deal. So there is time. But as of right now, there is a stare off between uh, the Jazz and the Knicks. There's been no new communication. We'll see when the Knicks want to get back in this mix and start to reemerge and reengage. Uh, this dance could play out over these next couple months.